All right, now let's do a couple of reflections now that we've looked at what the concept is. How do you actually reflect a shape? So let's start with this triangle. It's a pretty simple one. And here's the basic process. One, decide where you want to put your mirror line. And again, the mirror line is the line around which you reflect the shape. So for me, it's really easy just to choose one of the axes. Uh, that means I don't have to draw another line. So for this triangle, let's reflect it around the x-axis, okay? Then you pick a few key points. Um, I picked a few like this. Actually, let's switch these around. One, two, and three. Three points is all I need in order to draw a triangle, so if I pick three points, that'll be enough. For a line, you could pick two points, and that would be enough. For a square, you'll need four points. Okay, and then you measure the perpendicular distance from your key points to the mirror line. What I mean by that is I want to measure the distance from, for example, this point to my mirror line. And this is the perpendicular distance. So I'm not measuring from here to over here. I'm measuring here straight down to where the line from this point to the mirror line forms a 90 degree angle. So from here to the line is one unit. So I'm going to move the corresponding point one unit from the mirror line. So here we go, starting at the mirror line and then one down. All right, let's do point two. So point two is one, two, three, four, five units away from the mirror line. So I want to move its corresponding point one, two, three, four, five points down. And then let's do number three. So three is one unit away straight from the mirror line. So we just move it one unit down. And that's enough for us to draw a triangle. Boom. Right there. So that's the reflected image. Alright. Now let's look at reflecting a line. Alright, I've got a line here and this time to mix it up I'm going to call the Y axis my mirror line and I'll reflect it around the Y. So I decided where I want to put my mirror line just use the y-axis and pick a few key points. I only really need two points in order to draw a line, so I'm just going to pick out two points. Uh, there's one. Yeah, let's put this in front here so we can see. And um, There's one. Okay, now we measure the distance straight to the mirror line and put the corresponding points the same distance away. So point one is one unit away from our mirror line here. So I'm going to make the new point one, one unit away. So here's the mirror line and then one. And then our second point is one, two units away from the mirror line. So I'm going to make my new point two, start at the mirror line, one, two. And that's enough to draw our line. So let's see if I can do it. Uh, it's not lined up very well. Let's see. I'll fix it. Let's make that green. And let's move that. Yeah, you get the idea.